so in this video uh, I'll show you how to install jacket uh, in the main engine cylinder head so once you remove the jacket you have to ensure the area is completely clean so after cleaning means cleaning means just to remove all the rust and everything inspect properly and uh, next thing what you need to do is uh, you have to keep the jacket which you are going to replace it over a strong wood thick wood because uh, the jacket is very heavy and uh, you have to hang the cylinder head with the engine room uh, crane next you have to prepare the o-ring surface and install the o-ring we have two o-rings for this uh, cylinder head uh, jacket so once you fit the jacket, jacket uh, o-rings while fitting only you have to ensure the o-ring is not uh, turned or something and once uh, you fi fixed it you have to clean it with the help of clean rags so that no impurities sits over the o-rings so once the o-ring is placed next thing we need to do is you have to apply vaseline over the cylinder head and also the jacket the purpose why we are uh, fitting means uh, applying the vaseline is the vaseline has a nature of uh, making things ease up like uh, it slips so when you are lowering the cylinder head it will go inside the jacket very easily it don't get stuck anywhere so ensure the vaseline is applied on both the side both jacket and cylinder head next thing is you have to lower the cylinder head very very slowly and uh, you have to use the engine room crane for lowering this as I said earlier it should be uh, in place so next thing is while lowering ensure the bolts thread is aligned for this jacket we have four uh, bolts so align according to that bolt threads so now we are lowering the jacket very very slowly because if you lower fast there is chances for the o-rings to so now we are lowering the cylinder head you can see the first o-ring bottom o-ring went inside the jacket and uh, check for any damage while installing the cylinder head inside the jacket so we had made ready stud bolts for jacking the jacket over the cylinder head so total four number of stud bolts we made it ready what you need to do is you have to fit and connect it thread it along with the cylinder head and then you have to tighten the stud bolts so what happens is when you tighten it acts like a jack and it lifts the jack and fixes along with the cylinder head so once you fix all the stud bolts in the place next we need to do is the measurement of the height so now uh, we are uh, placing the stud bolts in place next thing is we put a mark over the bolt nut the purpose for uh, putting a mark over the bolt uh, nut is we can easily know how much turn we are turning while tightening the jack so now we measure the height of the stud one two and for all the four studs the height should be same that is the reason we are measuring the idea is when tightening the jacket should go up evenly so if one turn is tightened port side next turn should be tightened by the people who is doing the tightening on the other side so this is the funda so we are doing that so all four nuts if some engines have two nuts some engines have six so whichever studs we have we have to tighten it equally and how you ensure is just check the height height should be same for all the studs you can see now the 
jacket which is kept over the wood will come up and that means the jacket is going towards the cylinder head so you can see here yeah, you can see the jacket is coming up already so it is touching the top pouring so again this is also a very critical uh, space because this pouring should not get damaged while we are fitting the jacket in place so you have to always keep it in mind that you should not damage the o-ring while fitting the jacket if you damage the o-ring then again you have to do repeat the same job and it is fitting a jacket with cylinder head is really a hard job so only on the first time do it properly so you can see the jacket is already lifted up so okay now we are jacking it again towards the cylinder head okay so the job is going on it for uh, doing this job it will take at least six to seven hours to complete if you are doing it properly and if something went wrong if the alignment is not proper the jacket can get stuck in middle of job then it will take a day or more so whenever you do this job please ensure you are doing it with high patience and high precision the height should be very very important if not the jacket will stuck in between and you cannot complete the job the worst part is sometimes the jacket gets stuck and you cannot remove the jacket also that happens in lot many times and that is the reason uh, i put this video so that uh, people can understand how to fix the jacket in place there is a double pin in the cylinder head you can see that that double pin should fix should set along with the cylinder head cylinder jacket so when it goes inside that means the jacket is perfectly in place so this is there is one only one double pin in this engine some engines jacket uh, means the cylinder head have two double pins you have to ensure this double pin is kept in place we are doing the final tightening you can see the jacket is almost uh, along with the cylinder head and you can see the double pin is uh, almost fit in place yeah once the face to face is achieved then your job is completed so once this is done you can see face to face is achieved then you have to fix the you have to remove the stud bolt and fix the tightening bolt for cylinder head and jacket I believe this video must have given you some information and idea about how to fit jacket along with cylinder head. Keep watching, keep supporting. If you have any doubt, please put in comment box. Definitely, I will reply you. And uh, simple job, but it should be done very precisely. And uh, patience is highly needed for doing this job successfully. So, thanks for watching. So, now we place the cylinder head jacket over the wood and uh, remove the stud bolts. Once the stud bolts is removed, as I said earlier, then you can fit the normal bolts and tighten it along with the cylinder head and jacket so always use copper slip or any anti seizure while uh, putting the studs in place bolts in place thanks for watching thank you all thank you guys